Okay. And Rob, uh, hard not to get mesmerized by some of these uh, great team photos which uh, line the walls here uh, at the ramp as you uh, enter the Edmonton Oilers dressing room. And uh, we're going to make our way through, but about one step in, I'm going to stop the cameraman because I think this is one of the neat things uh, with the NHL is that you've got these uh, dryers uh, heating up these gloves. And uh, specifically, you wonder, well, how do they make certain that they don't get the wrong gloves? Well, it kind of gives it away here when you've got Gator here for Jason Smith. So you know that you're not going to end up with the wrong set of gloves. As we make our way through, we discussed, uh, well, first of all, uh, not many sticks, of course, because normally that stick rack, if the Edmonton Oilers aren't playing or aren't practicing, is uh, is full of sticks, but not many right now, except for some of the injured players, uh, the likes of you got Steve Steos, uh, number 24 there. We hope that he's uh, feeling well once he gets uh, his knee surgery and he's back, a pivotal member of the Edmonton Oilers blue line. We're going to sneak in here, and Brian Ross, I'm not going to bother Brian. Hey, Brian, how are you? Hi, guys. How I wonder you? if you got a quick second for us here. You just How do you watch all these TVs? Oh, you know what? You get your eyes go about four or five different directions. You get used to it over the years. So. And uh, are you in contact with uh, Bill Moores in, in this case tonight? What kind of information do you two try and translate to each other? Yeah, both Billy Moores and uh, Craig Simpson's up top, but we talk through the whole game and, our, you know, different things are breakdowns and things that we can do a little bit better. So we've been a little busy tonight. Uh, Brian, thanks for this. Thank you very much. Brian Ross, video coach. How many years now? 21. 21. That's it. Uh, you're going to get a watch pretty soon the way things are going. Uh, one thing I do want to notice and mention to you guys is the fact that uh, we talked about how many players the Edmonton Oilers have. I mean, this is a huge dressing room, but there isn't enough room for everybody to have their own stall the way things have been going. So here's just a, a shot of uh, a couple of seats. And you want to know who sits here? Let's go, uh, let's go inside his pants, if I can say that on TV. Tom Gilbert. There's Tom Gilbert. So he's the guy that's one of the players that is stuck here because of all the injuries and the fact there just isn't enough room in this room. Okay, i got to get out. The game's almost over. Back to you. All right, Gene, thanks very much. Uh